Five, four, three, two, 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 one, one, one. Hey, hey what's poppin'? You're not tuning into the greatest podcast in the world. Sorry to disappoint. I go by the name of Marcos Alexander. <laughs> Cameras, the bartender. Yo. To my right side, controlling my eating, mm. controlling Yonkers, mm. controlling Mount Vernon, yes, controlling Gone Hill, Woo. controlling Westchester County. Damn. And now a moment of silence. He controlling Fordham too, you heard? Oh, oh damn. Big gangsta, Chris. Huh. And to my left side, uh, he only drink Blue Label, so they call him Mr. Blue Label himself. $10,000 dog. $40,000. No, not $40,000, nigga. $100,000 BMW. Moneybags, a.k.a. J-A-I. Hi, man. And I got money, house, money and house. Thank you for always watching the video. Like the video right now if you made it this far. Subscribe to the channel if you made it this far. Also, if you listen, podcast through audio, we're in every platform. That's all I'm going to say. And remember, every Friday we live, not at 8.30, but 9, 9 p.m. 9 p.m. we live on YouTube, YouTube Live. Every Friday, come join us and mess with us in the YouTube Live. Every Friday at 9.30 p.m. I'm 9, 30, I'm 9, 9 p.m., 9 p.m. Yeah, let's be Sometimes honest. we'll be a little bit uh, late. Sometimes, yeah. Hello? Yo, Draymond Green, watch your fucking mouth. Yeah. Wow. Draymond Green, watch okay. your fucking mouth. Yeah. Okay. Paul Reed, we easy, we ain't easy, nigga. Yeah, yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Stop Keep, fucking playing with us. Keep going. That's two L's in your, in your rib cage, you heard? Keep going. That's, that's two L's. That's, that's more people. Who else? Jordan B, get your fucking weak ass knees the fuck out of here. Your, your other brothers. Fuck out of here. Your brothers. Roberto, shut the fuck up. Your other brothers. Kyle, shut the fuck up. You mm. heard? Don't fucking play with us, you heard? Nick's tape. Nick's tape. Nick's tape. Watch your fucking mouth. Nick's tape, nigga. Get, get me out of here with his bum ass knee, nigga. Watch your fucking mouth. Fuck out of here. You, know you, you don't got nothing to say? You don't know got nothing to say? It's that we, we, wa we watched them win. <laughs> then outside was like, we going to the chip. <laughs> <laughs> All I'm going to say is New York is two up. You heard? Yo, New York is two up. I'm just going to say this. If we ever get near to the championship, New York is going to close down. Yeah, they're going to have 40 yeah, seconds. Have, bro, 40 if seconds over Chris. The, if we make it to the Eastern Conference Finals, now next round we're going against the Boston. No, no, no. We're no, 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 Milwaukee. No, we're going against Milwaukee. Milwaukee or Indiana, yeah. yeah. We up right now? People saying we up we right now. We yeah, up, we up. You heard? Watch we up too old. Yo, Draymond Green, I let, I'm going to let that one slide. But watch your fucking mouth, all right? Let watch your talk. fucking mouth, Draymond. Yeah, yeah. Whoa, Shannon Sharp. Shannon Sharp, what? Ooh, ooh. I, I love you, but watch your fucking mouth too. Yeah, uh -huh. Watch your fucking mouth. Yeah. Well, fuck with this us, nigga. This New York, you heard? This New York, you heard? I, I, this I New the, York, you I heard? I have the urge to say you suck my dick, but if I say this to him, he will fuck me up. Yo, <laughs> shout out. All I want to say is shout out to Dante Divin Divincenzo yeah, for the, closing the out the game. You heard? What the fuck? Shout was out to name Dante. Was? David Chenzo. How about you say that nigga's name? Shout out to that nigga for closing <laughs> out the said, game. You heard? Shit. You heard? We are side. You heard? We are side. Yo, that name was All right, let's start the right way. That name let's, was mad difficult. Let, I know. <laughs> let's start. Let's start the podcast. Um, by the way, this weekend, y'all seeing Chris right next to me, right? He's tired of seeing me, bro. Chris see me every 24 hours. Yeah. Our, li our live became a YouTube video, but <laughs> Chris is tired of seeing me, and I'm tired of seeing him too, though. So that's why he probably hyping shit. You know what I'm saying? We was watching the fire at Chris' house. We also did a live on Chris' house. Yeah. This weekend was fire. That's how my weekend went. You heard? Yeah, this, this weekend was was a vibe. My sorry, my voice sounds kind of raspy, trying to kind of trash. We did like thirty five videos, nigga. We did mad videos. <laughs> we did a bunch of bullshit. 
Yo, shout out Ohm. I also want to say shout out to Ryan Garcia for getting everybody paid. You heard? Yes. Everybody in the paid. whole world got even paid, me. nigga, even on Saturday, me. nigga. Even me. Yeah, even the, even the bartender. Everybody got paid on Saturday. You heard? Shout out to Ryan Garcia, though, boy. Let's talk about about the fight a little bit, though. Yeah, let's talk about the fight. How was the fight for you? Um, it was a it cool was, fight. At the beginning, it was kind of not entertaining at all. Yeah. It shit was a trash fight. But yeah. I, I feel like after the fourth round, it's, it became a really, 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 really good fight. Yeah. Really good fight. Um, I showed a bet. I showed a bet, too. Shout out to Ryan Garcia. Everybody doubted you. Yeah. Except for you me. right. Except for me and the bartender and, and my and boy, Franji. And Franji, yeah. Franji. Uh, we... Put, we got we made some bread. We made some bread off Brian Garcia. Yeah. Devin Haney, pack it up. Yeah, he pack was 31 and 0. Now he's he 31 and 1. He wasn't ready for Ryan Garcia. I'm sorry. Yeah, man. Shout out to Ryan. You know man. what I noticed too? The rehydration clause, the no rehydration clause is is a big factor. Real big factor. Because I feel like yeah. I feel like if Ryan Garcia would have never had that clause in his contract, it would have been more competitive. It would have been more competitive him and um Tank Davis. Okay. More I, 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 don't, I, I, I still think he might have still lost. Exactly, yeah. Because he, he did get out of box. I like yeah. that you fix. But it would have been more competitive. I like that you fix it. No, oh, well, he said it before. Mm-hmm. I agree. No, yeah. yeah. But yeah, um, how was your weekend, though? My weekend was all right. Weekend, my weekend was valid, too. Like, got drunk with my fellas. Um, yeah. Shout out to Julio, too. Yeah, shout out nigga, to my, shout nigga out to got me leaving Chris' house at 5 in the fucking morning. Nah, I left that like six, 6, 6 in the morning. Shout out to Julio. The sun was out? Yeah, the sun was definitely and out. The, and then he said, one more hookah. <laughs> No, Julio. Julio said one more fucking hoop. At 6.30 a.m.? At 6.30 a.m., Everybody got bro. that front. Everybody got Chris, that front. And then Chris was do, down to do it. Yeah, why not? I'm like, nigga, no, we not. We leaving, nigga. Put your coat on, nigga. We leaving, bro. <laughs> Mark, Marcus was like, like, like the mom. Ya, 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 bueno. <laughs> but yeah, my weekend was fine. How was your weekend, boy, Tando? Um, It was all right. I chilled with y'all for a little bit. I made my money. Yeah, boy, Tando went, got paid, and left. <laughs> you know what's funny? When after the pod last Monday, uh, Jaime was like, "Yo, Chris, let's go, let's go chill in your crib to watch the games." He didn't even pull up. Never yeah. pulled up. He made the plans and didn't pull he up. He made the plans and That's never crazy, pulled up. Bro. Jaime is Jaime is doing a lot of weird shit. Like I can say now, later. So what is weird? A lot of weird here? shit. A lot of weird shit. Like I had a root canal. I couldn't go. My teeth, my tooth hurt, so I couldn't go. Well, I bet you you ate pussy. Of course I did. <laughs> but you don't eat the pussy with your teeth. The fuck. But the juices flow through though. Yeah. Like the and then they can fuck, can fuck your root canal, nigga. <laughs> Wait, what? They can fuck up your root canal, nigga. No, you can't. Like, so can pussy. Right. You, uh-huh. you ate your ass? No, 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 no. Nee, nee, sing ass. My Not bad. Jaime's uh, girlfriend, my bad. Oh, shit. Yeah, my bad. Yeah, no, yeah. no, no disrespect. No, no my disrespect. Bad, you know what I mean? Yeah. But no yo, let's start. Let's start the park. Let's start. Let's start the park. I wonder, I wonder about your relationship, right? Y'all lie, right? Mm-hmm. Of course. So you do. I will ask you will y'all go to a nude function with your partners? A nude function? Yeah. Anything that is well, like, nude. Like a beach, like a nude beach? Anything that is nude. Honestly, yeah. But oh, you, you know, there but you, know you have to be nude too. Then you go yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, so you would? <laughs> I want to see like old saggy titties. <laughs> so oh, you're wow. just going to look at all the people. But what, what else are you going to do? Everybody what else are you going to do there? Go. I want, yo, if I, I'll be the type to take a honey pack and a Viagra at the same time. And you will walk with your dick on? walk with it like that. You think you're gonna be the only one like that? Those are viejitos. Yo, yeah, but yo, why you shit like that? It's my compass. Do you think your girlfriend will be? <laughs> you think your girlfriend will be with it? Uh, maybe not. Maybe not. Right? No. How about you, Jaime? A hundred percent no. Why not? I I look disgusting. <laughs> yeah, but it's not. Ju- it's not a judgment zone, bro. You think no one will you think be that looking worse that than you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. there will be some. Because you know, usually yeah. people that do that is older couples. Yeah. Anytime, yeah. you play. You've played in the wire before, right? YMCA. Yeah, of course. Yeah. When you go into the locker room, them old dudes, they be talk, talking to you with their little... They, what are they the little like, dick out? Little small, they have the smallest penis, right? But they have huge balls, like huge balls. And they just, they're talking to you. Yeah, man, good game out there, brother. You you really do your thing. Is like, that an American culture nigga, put on, thing? Put on, put on, put on yeah, I think so. Put, put Is that on. an American thing? I think it's Europe. Europe. I think it was Europe that started for the nude beach and nude all of that. I think because yeah. where I'm from, that shit, is the, we don't fuck with that. Europe is more open-minded. Yeah, yeah you don't see the canoe beach. They get, they get, nah, nigga. Yeah, that's, that's a European thing. Yeah, oh, okay. that's a European thing. European yeah. thing. For sure. How about you, boy, Tanda? Will you be down for some nude functions? Ooh, I feel that? like it's when I'm older, I'm going to be a that be with that. Oh, one of the Viejo Yeah. Okay, I I'm actually like surprised about you saying uh-huh. yes to that. Well, I'm gonna say no. I said no. no I'm saying even like if your girl told you like, yeah, even if your girl be with her, you be no. You say no. Yeah, I've already I've already come to realization. 
I'm, I'm accepting my body already, bro. You, you, my, I have it. My penis is not gonna grow anymore. I have it. <laughs> yeah. And like that's nothing it, you bro. Can do about it. Nothing I could do about but it. But like. everything is about confidence. Yeah, the, but there's, there's no confidence. You cannot confidence. walk in with the most confident with a little ass dick. Yeah. They gotta get he's confident. Sure. So what with if a little dick? What if he is? Can you be confident with a little dick? Yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah. Look at me. That's serious. Yeah, but you don't walk out with your little dick into the street. Yes, I do. I've done it before. You walk out with yeah, your my, yep. I almost got arrested and all that. That would be crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> so, well, do you feel do you feel bad when you go to a doctor and they have to touch your little dick? Uh, you feel like self conscious about no. it? No. Right, the, the last thing you want to do is to get like a a boner while you're at the doctor's. Like, it's Se weird. Like, right? This shit is fucking weird. Yeah. Question to y'all: Do y'all care if your partner don't have the same the same religion as y'all? Do we care? Yeah. I do care. Um, <clears throat> in most relationships, it's a factor. Believes in Allah, and, and you believe in in, Christ, in Christianity. You believe in Jesus. You know, it's a conflict of interest like, as far as how you're going to raise your kid. Yeah. Are you going to celebrate Christmas? Are you not going to celebrate Christmas? You can't eat pork. Can you eat pork? I cannot live without pelin. I'm sorry. What about like being with somebody that's atheist and you're not? That's easier than having a different yeah. relationship. Okay. So you asked your girl before dating her about um, what's your religion, right? Yeah, but most Dominicans are Catholics, so... So you was like, I don't yeah, like, yeah. Most Domini my girls Dominican, so most Dominicans are Catholics. So usually, people who are Dominican believe in Jesus, um, and yeah. So usually, you don't have to like have that um, conversation. It depends also how serious you carry the relationship. Like if you're if you're like a very strict person with you know go to church every Sunday. Yeah, that's I, true. I think that is for me. It's more like uh, probably not. But if you're like a Catholic, like most Catholic. <laughs> But they don't go to church every Sunday. Yeah, they don't go to church. Every it will be easier. But yeah. Yo, um, quick announcement. Uh, Jokic already has a double double in the first quarter. There's four minutes left. <laughs> um, I was gonna ask, would ya, if y'all get married, would y'all want to get married through church? So I'm not a Catholic person, but let's assume that my girlfriend is. Yeah. And she wants to do it. I will, yeah, I will. I will okay. Mind. But I'm not a Catholic person, so. Um. Okay. With the same, with the same question, I wonder if no, y'all girl. No, you didn't answer. What? You I, ask, I ask everybody. What? If you if you was to get married, will you do it on yes. in the church? Yes, but I don't got my pri la, la primera comunión. I don't have that. But you if have I to, if you have have to have no, it? but the thing is, when you're getting married, they do that in a week. Like if you're getting married, oh, yeah, and, and you don't have salt, and you haven't done your shade, you could go and do can it. I, in can I can I be honest with something? So when I was younger, I did the primera comunión. Yeah. And I have never ate the bread again. Why? Because when I was no, because when I was younger, you, like Chris said, in Dominican, you always Catholic. And when yeah, I did, most, 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 most are Catholic. And yes. when I decided to not be Catholic, it, it's not. I decided it's just more, I learned more different religions. Yeah. Um, I said that it's disrespectful for me to eat the bread because yeah, I don't is. follow it. Even though I did the first communion, I, I completed. You're not everything. supposed to eat the bread if you had sex before marriage. Oh, if you didn't get married in church, oh, you're really? not supposed to eat that bread. Okay, that's so crazy. we got we a, yeah, a lot of people. A lot of people sing. A lot of people sing then. Yeah. Yeah, people eat it to lie. To like be like, oh, oh to prove really? a point. Good to know. I didn't know that. Well, I so, forgot about it. So let's say y'all your partners have the same religion as y'all. When y'all started dating and now that y'all married and everything, and let's say 10, 20 years pass, will y'all if your partner changed the religion the religion? Will y'all have a problem with that after so many years? It all depends how intense yeah. it is. Because if you, let's say, you start going to retreats and you're trying to force it on me and that's not something that I want, then it becomes a problem. Or like, like, or like vice versa, like I want you to go to these things and you don't want to go, then I know it's going to become an issue. So, so, it about exactly the religion. so I think it depends also on the religions that... that your partner decides to go. Yeah. There's some religions with different rules. Mm -hmm. So if she changes to one that affects your relationship with her, eh, I wouldn't, but it's 20 years too, so I won't, I won't break yeah. up. It won't be more like. But she should be, or him, should, they should be understandable. Like, yeah. we've been together for too long. Why you bring I, I have met people that are different religions and they marry for 30, 40 years and they're happy. Yeah. But they're not strict. Again, that's the word, right? Sex on the first date. Is that a turn off? All turn on. I thought that was a must. <laughs> oh, yeah, you have to have sex on the first date? 
Yeah, I know she's a woman. Nah, nah. Nah, for me, I won't say it's turned off, but I'm very, uh, I don't know how I can say this. Uh, I think for I me. I will doubt a lot. Yeah, I think for me is <coughs> if if you want to take that person serious, you wouldn't want that person to. Why you can't just feel like you that nigga? I, mean, I had I, like we had sex I'm that nigga. You're gonna question it as a nah. man. Yeah, as a man, be questioning everything. You're gonna be like, oh, she did this with all the the other guys she yeah, talked you're right. to. You're not gonna I question think. it. I, I do. I, I do be feeling like the man when I walk through. But maybe if you feel them, if you feel like the man, you feel like it was it was because it's you. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. But with me is. Mm-hmm. With me is it depends the vibe how the day is. True. Like if the day is so fire, like the chemistry is so fire, we kissing and shit. Like we already touching yeah. each other. Like it's that um, how you say confianza, uh, trust. Like, yeah, like the the, the trust. Confidence. Bit, no, 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 no. That, no. That's not. But the trust. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the trust. But like let's say in the first day, like we feel like we've been together for twenty years, comfortable enough. Like, and then it happened. I don't mind now. Sometimes you'll be in a day and the day is fire, but that will come out of nowhere. Like, like trying to ha- like the yeah. girl trying to have sex with you, like from out of nowhere. Let's say like I'm not expecting it, then it's weird. And there's gonna be mad niggas in the comments like, "Fuck out of here, nigga!" No, like, I get what you're saying. You're saying like, "Oh, you don't f- like the day is not going towards that." Like it was just it's fun. still fire. It it's was still fun. Fire. Yeah, have fun, but it wasn't like such like y'all didn't like Correct. get there. And then she'd be like, "Oh no, let's do this or that." Then, but let's yeah, be honest. And correct me if I'm wrong, most of the time when you have a very dope date and you say, like, there's chemistry, there's everything, yeah. before the date, there was a history of communication. Yeah. Right? Like there, it was fire on the phone. It was fire when we met. And text, the coffee yeah. and the taxi, whatever the case may be. And then it was also fire in the, in the date. What I'm saying is that let's say I talk to you, like, for three days and I ask you for a date and we go out. It's fun and everything. And I really like you. I'm not talking about, I went to a date to fuck you. I went to a date to really like you. Because I really like want to get to know you. To get to know her. And you slept with me in the first day so fast, like this, we're no interested, just like quick. I will be happy the day, you know, I, I, I got a box. Yeah. But the next day, I'll be like, damn. The first day? She did that, probably do, she did that last week. Do the sex have to be good on the first day? If the chemistry like if, is up there, then if the yeah. chemistry is up the sex will be good. But what I'm, I, I want to ask you a question. Have you made a wine night stand your girlfriend before? Like, not one night stand. I mean, like, a person you fucked on your first day. Have you been in a relationship yeah. after that? Yeah, only one time it happened with me. How about you, Jaime? No. Not, no How about no, you, no, Grace? Don't remember, no. no, no. But mine was like, the chemistry was so fire. Like, the, the chemistry from the first day, it was so... Yeah. But we did a lot of things on the first day, though. We went dinner, club, afties. Like, I didn't want to be away from her. Like okay. the day, the first day, it made it made me feel like I didn't want to be away from her. But did you spoke with her a lot before that or no? No, not, so not like, like that. That was like literally that. a first date. Oh, it was literally, a f- but we did a lot on the first date. Yeah, but I'm asking. You. I respect yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I mean, look, I'm not saying it's bad. I'm just saying that it's a situation. It's situation based, but most but of the time, maybe I know most of the time it's not like that. Yeah. It doesn't go like that. Um, you been you been with me when a girl offered me sex? I remember. Yeah. And I curved the shit out of I, I even lie. But if she's too thirsty, then that's different. Yeah, that was the problem. No, that, was it, that was the problem. And she's I was too, like, nah, I'm out. If she's too thirsty, that's different. Bro, bro thirsty, thirsty, bro. But let's like, be no, honest. Why made her thirsty, though? I want to know. It was like, Obviously she, she saw me. She yeah. saw me. She saw me. She seen me before, but very fast. She yeah. saw me. And she was like, I can't let him go now. Like, basically, she didn't want me to go home. Yeah. And I had to lie. And me and Jaime left. But, like, yeah. she was thirsty, bro. Like, thirsty. And I was like, nah. But what she was doing? Like, she was on top of you? Like, no, nah, I'm leaving with you. I'm leaving with you. I'm leaving with you. Nah, but, like, I'm like, leaving like with you. saying it. Like, it yeah, was like, saying- I'm leaving with you. You're not going nowhere. Like, me and you leaving. We leaving. And I know myself. Know myself, like. She was ugly? Yeah. No, I didn't want to. I don't want to go. Okay, no, no. But I don't care. I, okay, it's not. Do you have any people? But, but she, she wasn't hot. But she was. Uh, she was uh, like, oh. Um, but yeah, but it was. She was too thirsty. Oh. That's, <laughs> yo, um, why lie? Why lie? You tell y'all tell people often. What is a lie that y'all tell people often? I fell asleep. Yo, I don't even think that's a lie no more. Yeah. <laughs> like I, but I, say, I don't I even say think it, that's I a lie. I say it like sometime, like, let's say one of my friends be like, let's go out. And I feel bad saying no. I'll, the next day I'll be I'm like, g- Can I'll I give you a sleep. trick? Can I give you a trick? What? When, I'm going to give you a trick for when people want you to go somewhere with them and you don't want to go with them. This is the trick. What you do is 
you call them. Let's say they called you. Yo, pull up to the spot. Pull up to the spot. We're waiting for you. And you'll be like, yeah, I'm going to pull up. You let 30 minutes pass. You call them on airplane mode. You put your phone on airplane mode. You call them three times. And then you don't go. No, right? I can say I And the next day when they asked That's you. Easier. When they asked you, you'll be like, I call you three times for the address. And we're like, you a liar. You never call me. You got the three on outgoing calls. But that's too much. I'd rather just I'm say, just giving you a see. trick. I'm just giving you a trick. And you text that picture. Look, I called you three times. You know, I picked up. Oh, but I never got the phone call. Oh, that's why I didn't go. That's that a trick. Not people know. If yeah. you don't have it, he has it. Airplane mode. Yeah, I had to do that. I had to do that because I'm for dates. Or you could just be like, bro, I'm not feeling it. I'm not going. Yeah. That's but that, that is the lie that you tell often. Me, yeah. I don't, that fell I don't asleep. Like, I don't lie. I know. I, I usually say... And I'm going to say, when I want to play video games, I don't want nobody to bother me. I said, uh, my phone is designed. My phone has to be 50%. My phone is designed. I can't think of a lie that I always say to people. But, I don't, but that's not like a lie, lie. It's just... It's mm, just that you want your own space. Oh, my own space, right? Yeah, Chris, nothing. Oh, oh, no. I have a big dick. I, I... <laughs> that's your lie? That's a lie. That's a big, fat lie. That's a good lie. That is a dis- dis- so when you come, when you gonna see that shit, it's, it's, uh, oh, hey, it's too late for you. What is something you used to be insecure about that you now have a lot of confidence <laughs> in? My dick size. <laughs> so you used to be insecure about your dick size. I thought that six and a half was small, but it wasn't. Boom. Oh, so you yeah. six point two? I'm not gonna lie like that. Probably right again. Probably my body. Nigga, you six feet. How you gonna be about your body? Well, you always say about something about your body, but you don't have a, you don't yeah, have a but, bad body. But the thing is, before I never used to like my body at all, and like now when I get drunk, I like take off my shirt and shit. Always. So now, like yeah, now, I, I don't give a fuck. You, you do have a lot of hair in your body. Yeah. I do have a lot of hair. You, better, you, better but you don't have a you don't have a bad body or bad body like you think you do. Yeah. But but that's my. But, but, that's, bef- but before I used to hate. That's my insecurity. So oh, when I was Steelers. younger, height. I was really, really, really younger. Oh, oh, you know, like, 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 maybe my like, legs. I got chicken legs. Oh, you do have chicken legs. That's oh. genetics. I can't do shit, bro. Yeah, like I really work out on my legs, and I can't. Like, you got the KD legs. Nothing, bro. Nothing. Yeah. Nah, chicken legs is impossible for you to fix. Like nothing, bro. Like I gotta, I gotta get a get a BBLs. And you gotta legs. get a BBL on my legs. <laughs> and put the fire on the leg too. Put the fire on the leg. Then massage it. That's still my. That's still my insecure. What? My body is still my insecurity. Me? That's the only insecure that I have. I never care about height. I never care about... Maybe me was my glasses. I didn't like wearing glasses. Really? Now I love it. That, yeah. Back in the day, you think that's Yeah, back in the day. No, well, it wasn't cool. I, I always been into makeup. So before I used to be like, oh, I don't know. I like, because of makeup. I can I don't do my makeup because of my glasses. But my dumb ass, I could have got contact. And that's what I did. And I'm good now. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I didn't, know, know, I didn't know having glasses is insecurity. No, but she said back in the day. Ma- she yeah, back younger. in the day, because I wanted to do my makeup. And when you have your glasses, like makeup is not what it used to, like what it is now. Before makeup, it was more work. And when you had glasses, it didn't look the same. My my accent used to be a, like, oh, insecure, but I don't care no more. Like for me, when I was I younger, really it was height. Like when I was 14. But then, I, as a 18 and up, I. All right, let's get, let's get on this topic. You think height and men should be an insecurity? No. Uh, define insecurity. Like, let's define it. What do you mean by that? Your insecurity. Your height is your insecurity. Like something that you don't so like. So insecurity means something that you don't like about you yourself. You feel like you don't it's, like about it's not good. Yeah. yeah. Right? About yourself. About yourself. Okay. So I dis- I don't think men should be insecure about height. Yeah. But society forces men to be insecure yeah. about yeah, height. That's like girls with no ass. That, yeah. yeah. Exactly the same thing. But the thing is, y'all can get ass. Y'all could get a. Uh, nah, 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 it's nah, not nah. that. It's not that common, bro. It's hey, not. Hey, it's not. It's but not. You still, it's that's not like. That's like. It is. It, it. I think that's like a person in a million, bro. That get that that surgery, bro. It's a hundred k. I think. But I'm. I feel like. Push, uh, I feel like height and men is a it's very. It's a very hot topic. Like every time I go on Instagram, like it's high, 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 and I think that shit is so dumb. It is. Oh, it is stupid. It I is like so, so dumb. Like so dumb because a girl won't talk to you, even if you're the same height. You know the average woman don't give a fuck. Those are those Instagram bitches. You think so? Yeah. You actually, you actually think this, bro? You think so? My cousin, I'm not a virgin, so, no, it so it's listen, true. <laughs> listen, my, one of my cousins. I'm not gonna say the person's name, but per, this person is very short, and all my life I've seen him get girls. 
all my life. So you, yo, this is actually something that I never like, heard all my life. I There's something that. I never heard. Like I always thought, like it was a problem, but it's a dumbass problem, the thing bro. Is, if you think about it, girls that look, oh, he has to be six foot, is because they want you to look good next Not to him. Not six foot, six five, six five, yeah, or whatever. It, it keep increasing every yeah, year. Yeah, whatever, because it's for pictures. Yeah. That's what the mainly thing it is for pictures for show. It's not even that. It's just a look. It's for a look. I just it's the wanna... same thing with guys that be like, oh, I like short girls. It's a look. Yeah, but we, we say that we like short girls, but well, if we got a girl, if we got a girl at same height, we No, but I'm just I, saying I would an date, example. I would date a girl that's taller than me. Yeah. 100%. I have dated girls that are taller than me. I get dated girl that she was six feet. But just don't don't rub my like don't rub like sun me like don't rub my head like. <laughs> yeah, I'm around, okay. nah, nah, come here, my son. Just sit right here. I just I just, so want, I just want to say to men like that are short and, and that's the insecurity. There's somebody for you out there, bro. I think there's somebody for you the out there. Is, don't feel insecure about that. The shit. thing is, Michael, you said something about should you feel insecure, and we all agree that we shouldn't. But also, you have to admit, in today's day, like we. Here we are in our late twenties, early thirties, right? Yeah. Yes. Late twenties. Yeah. I think we are very lucky enough that we grew up in an era where that didn't matter. We was half personality half. matters enough that you can get girls. Yeah. But nowadays, the young motherfuckers with social media, the young girls, if you really do not meet X, like X things that like you have to make X amount of money, X amount of height, you gotta have a Montclair. X amount of abs. You, you gotta have a Montclair. Oh, Montclair. That's crazy because. It's but worse uh, nowadays. There's short guys that, that are like great people, bro. Like, but the thing is, that like doesn't great mean, people, that doesn't bro. mean they cannot get anybody. No, no. no. Uh, obviously, yes. There's always someone for you in the world. But, but in, again, not, opportunity matters. So if you are taller, you have a higher chance of getting a girl next down the block. Let's say for a short uh, person, which yeah, yeah, yeah. I think what I think is um, personality. Because what about that tall guy? Is his he has no fucking and game I agree, whatsoever. But that, but that dickhead. Let's say dickhead, right? He will have 20 chances first. He will fail all 20. All right. But that short person who has nice personality will get one chance every month. Question. He better have to get it. Question. And your crew. What's your height? I don't, have, you, a, I don't have a crew. But what? <laughs> and your crew. Your circle. Your circle. And your circle. Do, is your height, are you bigger than half of the crew? Or are you smaller than the half of, half of your I'm crew? More, oh. Your boys. Your boys. Yeah, I'm like more, who I'm, are you in height? I'm more in the taller size. So it'd be how many people is taller than you and your crew? Probably. I don't think there's one. Bro. Probably like two. Two. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. you the third one, the tallest, right? And how many are shorter? The rest. The rest, the rest of them. The rest, but like how many? Like three, four more people. Six, seven, eight. I mean, he's in the above. And do those guys that are shorter than you? Did they had a problem? Like. Getting girls. I'm telling you, all my all my peoples, they have they're shorter. They're in the shorter, like yeah. And they've all my life, all my life, they've all gone girls, all my life. Cause I'm gonna tell you something. If you had a club, and some of them has gone a lot of girls, like a lot. You'd be like, damn, this nigga, yeah, that nigga again, a if lot. You, if you had a club. And you're a person that likes having fun and dancing and vibing, because more girls now like dancing and doing and yeah. dan- whatever. And you see the short guy dancing OD, and then you see this tall ass guy. Maybe he look way better than the short guy, but he's standing there like a bum. Girls gonna wanna be with the short guy because he's showing more personality. And I've seen that it. happen. Let me because I seen the opposite. I seen that happen all the time. <laughs> Let me go. But it all depends who you hang out with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. Let me go with Jaime. And your crew, your surroundings. I'm on the shorter side. You're on the shorter side. Yeah. Do you believe the tallest side? Do you have a problem getting girls around the tallest size? Yes. Why? In the same circle. In the same circle. So I, I, when I was younger, I liked to, and I told you this before. I like to see around because it's an interesting topic. Like I like to see how people behave with others and stuff like that. And I used to tell you, okay, that guy is gonna fuck that girl. How do you know? I don't know. Let's see. And it used to always happen the same way. So I noticed that every time I was getting girls, it was outside the crew. And I show you what happened outside the environment. But because competition matters. That's but me and you, for. me and you in the same side, right? In the same crew. And I'm in the short side too. Now you met. 
No, I'm in the short side. Okay, yeah, There's okay. like five people taller than me. Yeah. And I don't have that problem. And my cousin either don't have that problem. Yeah, so but what do you think is that? It's a ratio, though. You think so? It's a ratio of things. Like, for example, if I, I can get one example, it doesn't mean that it's true. But do you mm -hmm. try harder when you're not with the crew than when you're with the crew? Or you try the same? Uh, I, don't, I don't try when I'm with the crew. Okay, so that also, you cannot put that stats. No, no, no. You're no. trying the, but, when you're not with the crew. But you, you don't try because, again, I don't want to go to jail, so. Okay. <laughs> what do so, you mean? Uh, so, <laughs> the fuck? So, a man, I, I don't believe men should just approach women blindly. Yeah. Should you get signs before you approach? Yeah. I so, understand. when you're with the crew, those signs go direct to other person, and I'm not going to just jump in. Okay. Mm -hmm. But when I'm by myself, it's so it's, it's, like, it's called hypergamy. Yeah. So, if there's, uh, for example, you as a man, if there's 10 bad bitches, yeah. and the baddest bitch is there looking at you, who are you going to go for? Well, about his bitch. Thank you. So if there's 10 niggas and there's hot ass niggas, yeah. mid hey. and ugly. Hey, yo. Pause. <laughs> the girl usually will go first to the hottest. And if it doesn't work, go down, down, down. Besides that crew and my other crew, the ones that I grew up with. Yeah, I, but you're not tracked in there. I was, we, we spoke about this. Yeah, before. yeah, but I was, I was not the tallest, but I, was the short, I wasn't the shortest either, but they were all skinny. But I was like brolic. And I never had a problem. So I mean, I, you, you, but you got the Instagram DM saying that they like fat people. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's move on. If you had to, if you had to say thank you to the person that motivates you, who would be that person? Oh, me. Kobe. Kobe Bryant is the one that that, that motivates you. Yeah. He when when he died it was crazy, bro. But yeah. So you like for you you tend to look at like Kobe interviews and clips and shit for every time you want to get motivated. Yeah, I mean, even That's after the NBA career, like when he was writing his book. Yeah. Yeah. That's five. What about you, Chris? Pony Charla. Charla the God. Oh, that's who, who, oh, really? who motivates you? Yeah. Really? That's one person I really want to meet. Oh yeah? Chop it up with I thought you were gonna yeah, say your sure. button or some shit like that. Nah. No. Nah. For yeah. Well, Charlemagne though? Yeah. I'm mad surprised yeah, that Chris, with like, man, Chris says Charlemagne Charlotte. is the one that motivates him. Yeah, I would I would love to meet Charlemagne. So every time you look for motivation, you like look at Charlemagne and shit yeah, like that? The guy's career path, all that shit. Oh, his career path is crazy. That's How about matters. you, boy Tender? Myself, old me. Yeah? Yeah, I want to get better. The um, The person now that, motiv that motivates me now, it used to be myself, but I just wanted to give a shout out to my homegirl, Majeline. Oh, facts. Majelin be telling me some shit through DM, my nigga. Like, come tell him nas, you can wait for nadie, bro. Like, and that's the person that motivates me now. So shout out to Majelin. She's she been say. doing a good job in the gym, right? Yeah, bro. That's the person that motivates me now. For y'all, yeah, what are the top three qualities in a person? For y'all. Yeah. Top three qualities. Be as, be as details you can. I can, I can All right, I'm going to go first then. Yeah. Hygiene. I think... One of the top three qualities got to be hygiene, right? Personality. Be more specific. Though. Person yeah, meaning, um, that's all. meaning you have a hat. You have to have. You have to be a very sociable person. Okay. I think you got to be like in, in every type of cruise. I think you got. If you can blend in, in every type of crew or different type of people of walk of life, if you can blend in, I think that's a plus. And I think you got to be smart. To me. Those are the three qualities I look in a girl. As a as a significant other, you mean? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What How about you? Yeah? Um, I would say loyalty, hygiene, and truthful. Oh, to tell you the truth, truthful. I like people telling me just straight up, like, "Yo, I'm gonna be as detailed as I can." Her pussy has to be five inches shorter. Or what? Five inches shorter? Her pussy? Yeah. Because, you know, my dick has to be bigger than... Than her uterus. Exactly. That's very specific. What's the second one? Yeah. Um, her pussy width... <laughs> Are you laughing? Go, go, go. Has to be an inch and a half. Her pussy what? Has to be an inch and a half width. The width. Okay. So you be measuring everybody you think. So five, five inches. Specific. He five. said quite specific. He said. So I'll go again, go again. 
first quality. First quality. Jaime, let's take this serious. Hold on, hold on, let's go. Of the of the vagina has to be at least no, less ma- than five ma- inches. Maximum, max five yeah, inches. Because when that shit goes First, to six, number one I quality. actually got some damage in it. That's you know number I mean? one quality. Second quality. The diameter or the circumference of the of the vagina yeah. has to be at least an inch and a half. So my dick is thicker than that. So I can touch around, you know. Yeah, so, so you mean the, so can you can force the it. The max is oh, oh, oh. Uh, yeah, width. So you the, go okay. <laughs> Third quality. So she thinks I have a. So you can stretch it out. So you can stretch it out. Third quality. Then she can take it. (laughs) So she had to have a small vagina and take the very tight. (laughs) She got to take it. Yeah. So the three top top three qualities for JAI. You heard? (laughs) Bartender, your top three qualities. My top three has to be (laughs) somebody that could. Com- like conversation. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I thought you were going to say somebody that comes. Somebody that comes. Somebody that comes. No. Somebody who can conversate and have conversations, not just about. But you don't strike me as a talk a lot person. I don't talk a lot, but if I'm interested in. Do the you just want somebody to listen to you? No. No, because no? if, I, if I don't talk a lot, I don't. That's weird. Though. You, 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 do you look at the bartender as a person that is. Like that talk a lot? If it's a topic that she likes. Yeah, but what's a topic that she likes? Rihanna. No. Makeup. I have Bad good boy. conversation with my boyfriend all the time. Makeup. About what? About what? Why you want to know? No, 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 no. no. What kind of conversation you guys have? The patelito, the patelito line of this week. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No. Oh, we, the did, we did a cheating chicken today. No. You know, uh, besides the topic that we have, you know that to me, as your brother, like... Every time we don't have a podcast, like let's say tomorrow, right? You're not here, right? We be here lighting up a hookah and we have mad conversations, right? But it's like, I can never figure it out what she likes. I still don't know what you like. Money. All this whole entire life, time right next to her. Of 30 years. Of 30 years, I don't know what she like. Three decades. You still don't know I what do she not like. know what she like. Damn. She never give me like Damn. Damn. Vaca- Damn. vacation. But yeah. I feel like that's something everybody likes. Every, yeah, and I'm exactly. Really, I'm into like skincare, makeup. I'm not gonna talk to you yeah, about you that. Hair you should stuff. learn makeup so you can have a conversation. With I her. do know a lot about makeup, but, but like, to like, but the thing is, with my boyfriend, I don't talk about these things. So what kind of conversation are we have? We talk about shows. Like, let's say we're watching a movie. Oh, we go okay. in there. Oh, we talk, talk about it. You like, watch movies with your boyfriend? Yeah. Oh, cool. cool you sh- cool. Sh- you sure show you not on your phone when you're watching movies? No, I'm watching this movie. Because every time she watches a movie, every time I go, I go. Every time I'm chilling with him, we watch a show, we talk about it, we go in depth on it, like, no, this is what I think is going to happen. I'll be like, no, I think this is going to happen. What do you like that the world likes? Yeah, please, be, like be more normal. That, that yeah. Besides that. <laughs> Besides that. Besides that, food, restaurants. Everybody like that. But you said something that the world likes. People, that's too cliche, I think. Like, oh, but what is it? Cliche. Tell me one thing. Okay, so that's what I'm down. saying. I got like, 30 years. Chris, Chris. I got 30 years that I that I don't know what you like. I will give you an example. Chris, you like basketball? Yeah. But basketball, we have basketball. Is bro. Boom. Basketball is the same thing as food. Michael, you like bitches? <laughs> Boom. Holes, I love got holes. Over here. Bro, that's broad. It's the same thing I'm saying. Yeah, can you specific. can you tell me something that you think she likes? Money. Yeah, Probably I work hard. Boy. Chris, can you tell me something you think she like? Uh, food. She's wow. a, she's we all like it. eating. We she's all like not. eating. Okay, but specifically, I, I've seen the bartender chow down. Something that is weird that you think she like. Something weird. that's weird. Oh, like something that you don't expect me that, to like. Yeah, say something that you expect her. Think something that you think that <laughs> she like, but it's weird. Oh, ghetto no, shows. I, you know what I love? Like ghetto shows. That yeah. y'all haven't no. figured me out. No one does. Yo, I don't think no I one. Love no, I think no one does. I I think, not even my mom know I, what she like. I think she like ghetto ghetto shows. No, uh, what's like, that like shit like called? Stabbing people and shit. Oh. Reality TV. Uh, yeah, yeah, you like reality oh, I TV. I love reality. Like TV. a lot. But I always say this. It's nothing like. She's that a fan of Glorilla. Did I say the name correctly? Gorilla. No, no. Glorilla. No, no. You said it correctly. Bartender don't listen. <laughs> that bartender doesn't listen to. I don't music. listen to that. Sexy well, rap. I told you. I like watching. I like to listen to podcasts that are about crime, like crime. You stuff. watch podcasts. I listen to what uh, podcasts. Uh, um, that's that. that I that, could. That. I you could give you. That, that, I'm right? shocked. I could give you a few podcasts that I listen to. You you listen to podcasts. But I don't listen to what y'all. Yo, listen wait, to. wait. Second wait, wait. First, that's a first. Yeah. I could show oh, it to you. The bartender likes dogs. The bartender likes dogs. 
You and do. I like crime shows. I like all of that shit. You like, like dogs, crime. bro? Yeah, I love dogs. I, as soon as I move out, I'm getting a dog. What? Okay, I'm a I different want a person. Dog, like, I still feel like the, these things that we are saying that she likes is like um, man normal. Things. Man normal. Like, like, yeah, but like who has a cliche? Anybody will like. Well, I don't have a cliche. Well, anime? Yeah, that's like in computers. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah that, that is something. What, what that's about that specific. you? Something weird. Y'all don't know everything I like. Me? Sitting down? You like no? He so yeah, pee side sitting down. Yo, that's crazy. I still pee sitting down. That's crazy to me. That's crazy to be I I y'all know that I listen to much music. I love music, but that's that's, that's like weird. But, but it's but like okay, no, it's, it's more like, than K-pop. average. It's more than average. I think I'm feel. I'm uh, everybody listen to music. I think I overdo it. That's what I'm saying. Damn, that's crazy. Nobody figured me out. I don't oh, think my hyper. boyfriend figured she me hyper. out. She hype. She hype about this. She yeah. Hyper. No, she's a mysterious woman. I am. Um, if somebody asks you to make your favorite breakfast, what you making? Huh. La arroz frío de ayer, bro. De la nevera. La nevera. Una bichuela toda ña. <laughs> Corta la bichuela Corta ya. Corta la bichuela que la... Que nada más se ve el agua. El grano, el grano está así, el grano, señora. ¿Qué grano? Y un pedazo de pollo que no es pollo. So ¿Qué no es pollo? Right. Un, un ¿Tofu? Po- un tofu, una vaina rarísima. Ahí. And that's it? Yeah, as a brand new. But no microwave. You eat it fr- cold? No microwave. Nah, bro. Hey, well, yeah. Con con? Con con. Que con con? You dirty, you dirty, you dirty. You never ate cold rice in your life? Yeah, cold yes, rice. Yes, but no. You have no. never ate no, cold rice in your, your life? You niggas is nasty. Yo. I had cold rice with cold beans Cold rice is before. crazy. That's what I'm saying. I ha- think the only way you can eat cold rice is at sushi. Wait, wait. Have you never ate cold rice Not with from cold beans? Not from the nevera, beans? though. I ate it like a little bit. No, que como que se temperature, me quedó. That's temperature, temperature rice. Nah. He's saying from the fridge. He's <laughs> saying from the fridge, nah. <laughs> Crazy, no, nigga. Nah. Crazy, nigga. You guys never been hungry. Con agua que a ti, un aguacate. Un aguacate, que aguacate el diablo. Se va rico. How about you, Chris? Uh, probably cassava. As breakfast? <laughs> cassava con mantequilla. In the morning, eating cassava with butter? <laughs> yo, 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 mom got to be. It has to be the garlic one, though. Oh, that shit, that shit, that shit, that shit, though. The garden one I think bro. if you eat cassava as a breakfast in the morning, you you you're throw you throw you're gonna catch flu everything, my nigga. <laughs> <laughs> for you, you to dry swallow, ass mouth because you your mouth is always dry. For in you the to morning. swallow some cassava in the morning <laughs> with butter. I never see Michael eat cassava. <laughs> you know I like the, I like cassava. I actually like cassava con chicharrón, muchacho. Yeah. That's your favorite breakfast. Nah, 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 nah. Oh, wow. <laughs> I forgot about the perfect portion. That yeah, that's like your favorite breakfast. <laughs> Um, if somebody asks me to make my favorite breakfast, I'm making a, a fire mango. That's mango one of my favorites. But the thing about mango is that it has to be right though. If you if when you eat mango in the morning, it's gonna send you in the bathroom. Yo, and the next three hours you're going to the bathroom. I wanna tell you this story. No, no, seriously though, wait, before you say the story, uh probably fruits. As a breakfast? Yeah. Okay. I'm not a breakfast guy. Like so. fresh I went to a trip to the pole when I was right. Mm-hmm. And somebody was making mango. One of the guests was making mango, and then some other girl was like, put milk on it. Que le echa la leche. So the mango? Yeah. You ever had that? I, I, I know with the, That's with the potato. Shit. I know That's with the potato yeah, thing. Yeah, but mango with leche. Never. 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 Yeah. That's crazy. That's in Puerto Rican. It was right? good, though? Nah. No, I don't didn't pull, have that. She, we told her to do her don't shit pull. separately. Don't put that on the Puerto Ricans. You how, know what how, I like? How did, how, did it, how did it look? It looked like, you see when you get cereal and you put, um. Oh. The yeah. platano was Yo. swimming on that to shit. To the Dominicans. And then on top of that, they had onions. To any Dominican out there, do y'all pull milk and your mango? Because if y'all pull milk and your mango, that's fucking crazy. Ugh. That's crazy, You bro. know how that way... Milk and mango is crazy. I think that the, shit is disgusting. I think the goat way of making mango, and that's the way I do it, is I usually take one green banana, uh, plantain, sorry, one yellow plantain, yeah. I mash them together. Oh, that's good too. Right? I don't do only green or yellow. I do both. But you could do just green too. Yeah, you could. But yeah. I, I like the, the, the sweet. Both. Yeah, yeah, it's good like that. And then I do, uh, ch- not cheddar cheese. Uh, what are you saying? No, no, it's cheese a is, papa. Cheddar. Uh, is, is that a correct Yeah, one? cheddar cheese. And when, I, and when I melt it with mantequilla, it's over the cheddar cheese. Bro, that shit hits. If you don't put butter in your mango, you're crazy too. You know Who what doesn't time? put butter? I don't know. You'd Bro, be surprised. That, this is what happened when you're a single man living by yourself. Tenía dos plátanos solo en la nevera. No butter. I'm just no platano. Say, I just want to say this. No I, butter. No platano. Jaime is going to be. With $5 in my bank account. That was when I was in college. Jaime is going to be the first friend I ever have that's going to make it to a billion. Why? Because I'm doing my own haircut and I'm fucking shit. He gave up. himself his own haircut. <laughs> yeah, look at show, that shit. Show, that show shit. the fucking haircut he gave himself. Look, look at this shit. That shit ain't even blended. Yeah, look at the front of the camera. Yeah, yeah. 
Look at he gave himself his whole haircut. He yeah, right. actually, He's gonna make it to Billy. I actually like it. It's not bad. You don't see the, the hair. Nah, right this here? Not, this side you is don't crazy. see it? I actually like it. So give okay, him give one. Me a, give me no, no, no. <laughs> give him break the machine. No, no, no. I'm learning. Hair, I'm right, learning. Cut. Give me a rating from one to ten. <laughs> Five. Is that bad? The I give, I give you like a six. It's a little bit above average. Yeah. Five, five. I, get, I give you for, like for a first you'll time, be, not for first try. You'll be, you be very no, no, no. serious. No, no. You give me a five? Yo, for a first you try, you got, that, you, you got half. You got half. For Nigga, first, you give me a five. For a first try, yeah. I could have gave you a two. You could have fucked your whole shit up. Bro, you know how. <laughs> okay, can that's I ask, a nine five. Can that's, I ask you nine, that's a seven. Can I ask you something? Oh. Why you did this? <laughs> yeah, please. I'll be Please. So I, I do a haircut every week, right? And body, then you calculate it. A, a month yeah, exactly, right. Like always. So I, well, I'm sitting in my house. I have all the clippers in my house since I'm in college. I have all of them in my house. I'm looking at my shit. I'm like, yo, why the fuck I'm paying this motherfucker $50 every week? And it, it doesn't even give me a towel in my face. And I fuck I did it. Do you, okay, did you watch a YouTube video? Of course. <laughs> Can you imagine? So, it was so he was like this in the mirror. <laughs> so now tap it a little bit more up, more up, more so, up. So just to explain to you a little why my face is not why, why you didn't blend it in like. Let me explain you why. I blend it. He, he got sleepy. No, no. He got sleepy. I did want to sleep halfway through. <laughs> I ain't going to lie about that. There's one guy I didn't find. Yo, motherfucker started his haircut. Yo, I'm going to finish it later. <laughs> Yo, I'm going to pay you. I'm going to pay you the money that I owe you, sir. <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm going to pay you the money that I owe you so you stop doing this. No, no, no. No, no, no. I will do it again. Yo, but honestly, honestly, it don't look that bad. It, it doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't. But you pointed out that it was kind of fucked up. Yo, when none of us noticed. Wait, let me no, see. No, let no, me no. see that side. <laughs> you don't see it? Yeah, all right. <laughs> This side is more Yo, faded than that. Yeah, because because I got tired about Friday, this. I like, oh, fuck this shit. On Friday, I'm gonna send you the money I owe you, so Yo, stop. So you can stop doing this. But let me explain. It's it's because because understanding. Can I ask you one quick question before you explain? Yeah. yeah. What did your girlfriend say? She was laughing. I would have been crying. She so was like that guy. Crying. You got, you got, but she gave me a seven. But it made sense. Seven out of ten. It my made first sense. try. She told you to keep doing it. Yeah. It's for you to not get bitches. <laughs> Yeah. She know what she doing. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and so you, That's and for you to not get bitches. But, but I feel fake. you because I do my own hair. So why my fade don't work? I lost the one card. Oh, okay. And I only had the one and a half. That's the reason it's not fading. So you lost it when you finished that side. I, I lost it so even before. Yeah. I, yeah, so you ordered, I, yo, 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 all right, let me let me tell you something. I'm not even lying. Let me I let you. Right here. Let me let Yo, you. Let me let you know why we're doing the title of this part is gonna now be like toner, Jaime. The toner his Jaime. haircut. Jaime. The toner is his haircut. I mean, like Jaime gave him some Yo, of his own haircut. Let me tell you something. Wait, that? No, in case you in case you didn't know, in case you didn't know, the pandemic is over. <laughs> <laughs> Just to let you know. <laughs> you, you can hit the barber shop. Wait, wait, wait. Like, wait, wait, wait no, no, bar, huh? And you don't hit No, no, no. Only go to the barber shop. Yeah, that's. I do. And your eyebrows too? No, no, no. I ain't nothing to you. I'm rapping my hair now. Yo, you took out your earrings for this? Too? You don't got earrings today. I, I never use earrings almost. Maybe rarely. I didn't even know you had Yo, earrings. Yo, matter of fact, I've never seen him wear earrings on. Yeah. Me either. I swear to God, I've never seen him with earrings on. He knows Yo. when I go out, but I don't use him. Like, the pandemic is over. The, but let me explain. Let me explain. Let me explain. <laughs> okay. Have you calculated how much you pay your bar every month? I re Have you done the math? Let uh, me tell me if yes or no. No, no, because I, I um eighty dollars. Yeah, eighty dollars a month. Yeah, because I, I only get so, twice every. Hair, I get a haircut every tw twice every a week. Two weeks. Every two weeks, so it's forty dollars. Eighty. Okay, I used to do every week then. Oh, you did every week. That's why. Yeah, yeah. That's, yeah, that's, that's why. I do my own hair, so I don't. No, I will try again. I, the most successful people that I know in my I, life I'm balding, do their so own haircut. I'm balding, so right. The most successful people that I met in my life do their own haircut. You're right. So, so you're not going to the barber no more? I, I never said that. No, but if I go out on a trip, I know I got to be clean. But <laughs> you need to let her grow. No, this is for his chills. <laughs> you need to let this, her grow. This is when like, he doesn't go out. He's going to do his shit. Yo, but oh. fuck with it, though. Every time I don't go out, I'm going to do my shit. Your shit's mad simple. I can do your shit. <laughs> <laughs> nah, 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 nah. Yo, come with your shit next part. I will come with my barber. Yo, Yo right. if I give you $50, dollars, you let me do your hair? <laughs> I'll let you give me your hair. If, if I give you $50? Yeah, I'll let you give me your hair. In the pot? Yeah. Bet. Let's do it. Yo, he said in the no, pot. You could give me, you could give me the, the, the C-Rain I have. 
and tomo pe pe la 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 sorun la sorun the four no or the three the two and a half Nigga, your shit is simple. Now you giving me and Chris a haircut. No, I ain't giving me a haircut. Chris, Why your not? haircut is simple, bro. No. It's not that bad. Because you got a girlfriend. You got a girlfriend, Chris. You got a girlfriend. You just don't worry about it. I don't have a girlfriend. That, like, it matters with me. You have a girlfriend. So I don't care. Yeah. Damn. All right, let's move on. Um, Name three things you like more than money. Damn, you're putting me hard there, bro. Food. Air. Oxygen. Water. You mean oxygen? Oxygen, water. water. I learned, I'm learning to love the gym. Yo, pussy, titties, and ass. Oof. That you like more than money? Yes. All right, so I'm going to go the serious route. Health. My mom. Well, when was the last time you hit the doctors? Health. Yeah. My mom. <laughs> when was the last time you hit the doctors? You didn't know you had the class before, the claps. No, no, they had no, no, don't put that on my jacket. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, yeah, you know, uh, uh, yeah, they put that in my jacket, hot class, nigga. You crazy? Well, what, what was it, though? Uh, the clemmy. A little clemmy. Yeah, oh, but it was like it was five, six years ago. Oh. Well, when was the last time you hit the doctors? That, that was five, the last time. <laughs> Five, six years it, it, ago. Gets, it gets my health. All right, keep going. Yeah, yeah. My three things more than, like, the three things I like more than money is health, my mom, and my sister. That's wow. the only three things that I care more oh. about. I, I, don't, the money. I don't claim people that love me if they don't give me money. Okay. That's crazy. Okay. <laughs> things that I care more than money, you put, you know, that's easy, bro. Ray. Oh, yeah. man. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't even like his dog. <laughs> he didn't even like his dog. Yo, babe, yo, come get this nigga dog. <laughs> um, obviously, family. Okay. Your girlfriend? Yeah. You love her? Yeah, of course. Man. But money, though? <laughs> Who said I love you first, Jaime? I'm oh, interested. yeah. Let's, let's interview Jaime real quick. I don't remember, to be honest. Um, yes. In the relationship yes. that you are in right now. Yes. Is this the girl that you have loved the most? Yes. Why? Oh, how you know, matter of fact? Because I know. I've been with her the longest. Okay. How about you? This is the, the longest. <laughs> so this is not my longest relationship. It's not. It's not? No. Not yet. Not, not yet, yet. Not yet. Before this, how many, how many years? Three. Three and a half. Three and a half years? Yeah. What, you, what was your age? Mm, I was 19 or 20. 20? 23. Michael, 20. is this the girl you love the most? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, shout out to my shout out to my home girl. It was, it was her birthday on Thursday, and I don't I cannot say her name, but shout out to shout out to my home home girl. That's happy the one, birthday! That's the one you love the most. Happy birthday! Happy birthday! That's yeah, my that's friend. The, I'm talking about my friend. That's, that's, that's my friend. Hey, right. don't do that. That's my friend. Oh, uh, that's your friend. Yeah, but the what you said? What was the question? Well, you <laughs> that's the girl that you love the most. That's your I don't have a girl. No, but that that girl as a friend. No, that's my home girl. That's home girl. You love her the most. No, that's my home girl, bro. We're not doing this. You got a boyfriend. Oh, you got a boyfriend. Okay. Yeah. Well, guys cannot be friends with girls. Yeah. No, that's my home girl. <laughs> that's a lie. That's my home. Guys can be friends with girls. You hit yeah. it? Eh? No. Nope. You, you hit? Sorry. No. I don't know. That's my home girl. Girls can't be friends with guys. No. Vice versa too. No. 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 I think. Tú tienes una mejor amiga, Jaime. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You. You do. Who? No, mejor amiga is different. Well, my be- like my amiga, best friend. Oh, no, not best friend, but he got a friend. I got a friend, I got friends, yeah, uh-huh. but not best friend. Una mejor, you don't have a mejor amiga, Marco? No. I don't, but I got friends that are girls. Yeah, of course, yeah. yeah. Um, I want one of them, too. <laughs> that's one of them. You, you, you want me to hook you up? No, no. But, but she like, she <laughs> like, I think she, she probably, like, I think she probably watched the like She like hype, she like hype. Yo, he nah, couldn't keep so. with that. I don't she think She was so. looking at his Yo, TikTok. you're going to get high, man. He's going to come to the next spot. Like, no, rapa el caco. Rapa el caco. Then people going to ask him what happened. Oh, I don't know what happened. I don't fuck it up. Yo, high best girl. My nigga loyal. My tamo, nigga loyal. Tamo my nigga loyal. I tested, I, I tested out for you that he's loyal. All the time. And he still doesn't. Like, have you be like this? Like, uh, uh, nah. Right, Yo, um, how do you tell your friend in a good way? How do you tell your friend in a good way that his hygiene sucks? All right, depending on which part. Yeah, so you're not my friend. So there's so there's kind of smell. <laughs> so there are there are some kind of smell that you could take. <laughs> No, no, nothing you can Cause take. you like, you like, like it depends. Different ways you can fix but it. But the thing is, if your man's right, my man's is if his, this his name is his name is Fulanito, right? Fulanito comes in. Richard, no, 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 Richard, 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 all right, entró Richard. R- Richard, Richard came, <laughs> his breast stink, and I know that from like all the time, all the time that I know his breast stink. 
I will always carry like a pack of gum. Like, yo, y'all want some what gum? What did he be like? So, I don't oh, want. So Chris but walk wait. around it. Okay, but what did he yeah, be like? I, I don't want. About at least when I'm around oh. him, I try to mask it for him. You understand? <laughs> you yeah. need it. You need yo, it. Hey, I'm, so. I'm, I'm gonna keep consistent, bro. You sure you don't want? <laughs> you know, you sure you, you sure? don't want? You, sure? you think my breath stinks? Sure? No, man. Yo, no. But, it tastes better for the hookah. Yo, but like, if he has a trifecta, so three times. No, no. If he has a trifecta, the breath stink. Carajo. Grajo and feasting, <laughs> we can't be friends no more. You won't well, friends. Okay, well, yeah, how yeah, about how about if it no how about if if it's only his breath? If it's only his breath, out. Thirty years, right there, for Richard. <laughs> <laughs> Thirty years. I just, I just with Richard breasting, breasting. I just can't. Can, I just can't have him next to me, like. Yo, Chris, why you always standing away from when we talk, bro? Because this shit is crazy. I would let him know that. Is he your boy for 30 years? You would let him know. I would let him know. I would let him know. For sure. You you you, no, 100% I would let him know. You a nasty nigga because Chris will take the breath no, for 30 years. It. Michael, but you took all the farts? The who farts? <laughs> but you let you let mujeres con grajo y vaina? Lo veo de high, pero lo has fumado? A few times. <laughs> The, I'm waiting for the third time. The third time. Yeah, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You haven't smoked one of mine. <laughs> the <laughs> third time, I'll be like, yo, <laughs> big dog, <laughs> big dog, big dog. <laughs> big dog. But anyways, oh um, <laughs> no, but, we'll get, but yo, you Chris will work around hookah. his. Chris will work around. I like Chris will like take if, the bad breath. If that's my man's, like if that's my friend, like we grew up together, I'm gonna have to take that L. But I'm gonna let him know, like, bro. Yeah, let's go to the dentist together, bro. Well, how, how can you tell him in a proper way? Like, yo, your hygiene. Nah, I would just tell him, bro. Like, yo, 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 your, your breath is. Yo, you, you have like an arriba. I'll be telling. I would tell him you have an infection in your mouth, bro. It's it's crazy there. Like that? Yeah. How will you do it? It's me. It's, it's me. like that. It's me. Hey, Chris. Hey, hey Marcos. Um, there's something we have to talk about. What? <laughs> that would not be the conversation. That would no, 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 no. be the yeah. conversation. Can y'all shut the fuck up? That's yeah, not gonna be a conversation with Chris. Chris, that's not you, bro. That's not you. Hey, go acting, bro. I'm blind. That's all right. That's all right. Okay. Action. Hello, okay. Yo, you might wear Margo. Chill, man. Yo, bro. Uh, real quick. Um, you ever thought about going to the dentist? Why? Like my teeth. <laughs> my teeth are fucked up or something. Why, nah, bro? I've known you for a couple of years now, and it's it's not getting any better. What you, you know, mean? You like know what teeth? I'm talking about? Like, how, you know what I'm talking about? I don't know, nigga. Tell me. Your breath stinks, bro. Like that? I, like all the time? Yeah. <laughs> how you haven't noticed this? Why you never told me this? I thought it was a couple of bad days, but that bad day's been every bad day. So my like, like even our, our, our quarters and shit, my shit be stinking crazy. At what? Like our quarters, like when we be out and shit with girls and shit, like yeah. I don't, I don't know how those girls be talking to you. <laughs> So that's how that's how he would tell me. Yeah. How would you tell him? How would I tell Chris? Like, yeah. like he got a hygiene text. problem. I would do it to text. Action. Go. You my man, Marco? What's popping, Chris? Yo, um, <laughs> I see. Me well, yeah, I had to why? tell you. I had to tell you something. That's why I made that long pause. I had to tell you something. Why you acting weird? Um, I think you gotta wash your clothes better, bro. Wash well, thing. Yeah, like all the time. All the time, bro. And it's like, um, Jaime told me, like, yo, this nigga stink. Like, Chris stink all the time. And I was like, you you, like, you like, serious? And then I started noticing after, like, Jaime told me, the bartender told me, um, Roberto told me. Now you say that everybody's talking shit about but so, Chris. But somebody told that's me. how we do it. <laughs> but somebody, I will, yeah, I will yeah, say wait. everybody. But somebody told me that's just a natural, that's a natural, natural cebolla smell. That, that you have? Yeah. Nah, bro, I think I think I, smell like I think you got to take it. They said I smell like a fresh supermarket. I, <laughs> I think you got to be I, I think you got to take like care the, of you yourself. You like the Jenaico? Que ya no se baña. Yo, let's keep it a buck. Oh, f- fuck the acting shit anymore. Yeah. <laughs> Who stink? <No. laughs> Who stink? Who really stink? I know for a fact I don't stink. I don't no, no, no. Nobody here stink. No, we're just playing, guys. Yeah, but, I'm the only nigga that be 40. Me puedo leer huevo a mí ahora mismo, te doy en... Yo, uh, yo, yo I'm not smelling that. What the fuck? Yo tengo, yo tengo baby wipe in mi casa. No, no, no. I'm only five. Ha, ha, have you guys gone multiple days without showering? I'm um, gonna be honest. 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 In pandemic, un aqueroso era yo. <laughs> you know it's crazy. You know it's crazy. Well, it. I did it. It was a long, it was I a long. Shower. I, I shower all the time. Tenía ya que el culo me picaba era. I shower all the time in the pandemic because I was with, with my ex. Oh, that's so okay. I couldn't like be have a one a one day off. Um, probably <laughs> the most off. I have is probably a one day off. 
One day off. One day off. For shower. You done yeah, it with your shower. girl being there too? 100%. <laughs> Un día entero. Un día entero, and the next day, like, she'd be like, you're going to go shower? I'm like, nah. <laughs> Are you girls okay with that? Like, without you yeah, showing? Because I don't stink. Like, I have. Yeah, a, I, don't have like, I, don't have, I don't have like a natural like I don't have like a natural Like, an odor. like yeah, an odor. I don't have an odor ever. Nah, but if you sweat. Bro, I, there was one day I played ball and went to go play a double header in baseball. Nobody can give you that shit. <laughs> but I understand though. Because <laughs> oh, after you play basketball, hold on, let me save you. Yo, you nasty ass no, nigga. No, you're nasty. After you play basketball and then you want to play baseball, it's when you get home, when you get home, you so fucking tired, you can't even walk. Yeah, you can't walk, bro. Like, but, you can't but that's the best shower. You just lay there. Yeah. With, yeah, a, with the cold water. Nah, nigga. But and you still especially, if I went, especially if I went 0 for 8. <laughs> oh, yeah. You I didn't even get no dirt on me. Nothing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, definitely. You know, you know, is, how about you, Michael? No, I, be the, honest. In the pandemic, I couldn't. I was no, with, with, that, with my ex. No, but we're talking about in general. What's the longest oh, you lasted? In general, oh, one like. Day, one day. One yeah, day. like one day. My, my usual. Usually, max is one day. How many days in the morning, bro? Yeah. Oh, que te picaba el culo. Me picaba el culo. <laughs> But the thing is, you know, <laughs> the, the, the cockroaches was like a hype as all, bitch. Pero yo sé qué fue lo que me pasó en ese, esa pandemia. No, 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 grajo, no, grajo, no, grajo, no. Pero yo tenía ese culo sudado. This thing is crazy. Sudado, tenía ese culo, bro. Yeah, they began to Have you done it? Have you done it? Have you done it with, like with your girl now? Like, have you been. Wait, 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 wait. wait, 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 wait few, day, few days chilling with your girl, you haven't showered? No, no, no. Ella te manda baña. No, espérate cómo se llama. No, that is crazy. Yo, my girl, they be asking me. If your girl sends you the bathroom. Babe, you're not going to shower today. I'll be like, ya loco, nah, mañana. Yo, it'll be crazy. Mañana. Your girl probably like, your girl probably her head, like, se inventa un par de vainas, so ya, so ya, like, oh, babe, let's go to McDonald's for you to shower. I still won't shower. Mamá, papá, para arriba. You go to McDonald's without showering, nigga? Yeah. Oh, that's crazy. Wait, you go to McDonald's, you shower before you go to McDonald's? <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? Do you, you shower, shower to go to McDonald's? <laughs> If we go to McDonald's right now, yeah, and, and we're gonna shower? sit down, we're gonna sit down and eat at McDonald's. I'm gonna shower. You just shower though. But the thing yeah, is, but I will shower again. That is, a, that is my rule though. I won't leave my house though. Oh no! Yeah, 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 no, yeah. Like, yeah. let's say if I have to go out. I'm out. No, I'm gonna shower. shower. Yeah. But let's say it's Saturday, right? I yeah. got home. I get home from work, right? God, Saturday is my half a days. Yeah. I'll be home by one o'clock, right? Oh, you didn't. Sh you don't shower. So. Before. No, I shower before going to work, right? In so the then, morning. And in the morning. So then when I come back, take my nap, whatever. And then whatever the, the the day goes on, I sleep the next day. Then it's Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> then you shower on Sunday. No, no, but yeah. So when I saw you on Saturday, you didn't. You so you do it. Yeah, but fuck, you do it like 48 hour thing. Yeah, let's have it. But you want it to you. No, the thing about it is a weekend thing. Yeah, <laughs> maybe it's a weekend thing. Maybe it's a weekend thing. Yeah. Yo, yeah, man, that's crazy. You're having some no sucio. No, probably we'll make cool. Bang, bang, I'm gonna make cool. That's crazy. Nah, nah. <laughs> Why would you say if your girl did that? Like What? she didn't shower. No, I thought I thought to my problem. Yo, now nah, girls need to shower every day. There's girls with a pH balance. Yeah, you have to shower. You have to shower. There's nothing more fire than a girl when a girl shower and she put that lotion from Victoria's Secret. You smell it all over. Ain't that better than that sweaty salty? Hometown. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you think it's just wild. Look, look Yo, at you know what? You know what? I hate the mother's lying. I'm not lying though, bro. I say, I say, cool fat people that we are. Yeah. Two or three days in mañana. Yeah. Is that Michael wakes every day, so he shows. My nigga, sm smell my arm. Nah, right I now. could tell you. You went to the smell gym. Mama, me smell my, my arm. arm. Me smell my, my arm, my nigga. Fight with smell. Marco because Marco sits on the hot on the top. I smell glorious, nigga. No, ese ese baño sentado. Yeah, ese baño. Yeah, I do. What's wrong? What's wrong? <laughs> yeah, for everybody listening, if you're not watching on YouTube, that's Jaime laughing. That's not a dog. That's not a dog. That's Jaime laughing. You can leave it. You can leave it. So, you know, I, I grew up with my mom and my sister. Yeah. My entire life, I had seen my mom and my sister sitting down. I don't sit. I don't so say. I sit down. I don't sit. Yeah, you imagine this fat nigga just sitting in the tub, bro? <laughs> yeah, I fuck. You know what? All right, chilly, nigga. Tira no jugada. Marco, you know what Marco does? Bubble bath. Marco oh, every day. Every that's day. fine. All right, that's fine. Bubble bath. He fun. does it every day. Though. Every day. Yo, the and problem my, is yeah. that every day I'm in the jacuzzi, nigga. The water all the way up, and I'm swimming every day, nigga. <laughs> It's true. Every day I'm swimming, nigga. Yo, the issue is not that. The issue is that he takes a shit sitting down. Well, obviously, takes a piss sitting down. Takes a piss sitting down. Then he jumps in the bathtub, 
Niggas. Saan kong bangkito na ako? <laughs> no. So, it's like, I lay on the bathtub. I lay. He's laying on the bathtub. I lay. I'm a lay. I lay on the bathtub. Why you just don't stand man, up? I will grow up with my mom. I'm on shower like that her entire life. And I was a kid. And I sit down in the shit, nigga. <laughs> I never Yo. shower. You shower standing up? Yeah. Yes. No, you wild. I'll be, I'll be there. So yeah, never the sit in, in the tub. Yo, I'll be oh, honest. The only time I laid in the tub was I when was I was laying down. Ball. Few hours ago, I was laying down. And I just laid down. When y'all was here, I was laying down. <laughs> <laughs> I was laying down, throw, tirando jugada, bro. The water subiendo. <sighs> tirando jugada, chilling, bro. That is crazy, bro. Yeah, bro. Now I swim every day, you heard? Yo, you different animal. But nah, nah. All right, we're going to go right yeah, there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yo, remember, every Friday, we live on YouTube at 9.30 p.m. Yeah, yeah let's go on. Every Friday, we live on YouTube at 9.30 p.m. So make sure you always go and join us in the live. And if you made it this far, make sure you subscribe. Call us the Bahama boys, because the boys is going yes, to the Bahamas, sir. you heard? We're going to do a blog. We're going to do a blog for y'all. We're going to do a podcast for y'all. Yo, should we do it live there? Yeah, yeah. we probably do we a do live. A we probably do a live over there, too, in the Bahamas. It's not no it, We are near. It's near. Well, not, not, not the. Oh, shit. Hi, man. We do. They, oh that's my God! Yo, before we end, the Lakers are winning as of now. As, as of, of now, now. seventy-two fifty-five. Yeah. Anthony Davis got thirty. I told oh, that's you. fire. Um, but yeah, we're gonna be in the Bahamas. We're gonna give you a cool video when we go to the Bahamas. Always watching the video, like the video right now. Subscribe to the channel right now if you made it this far. This is Sorry to Disappoint Podcast. Love y'all niggas. See y'all niggas next episode. And by the way, we made it to 90 episodes and we never celebrated that. This is episode 91. We're really? gonna celebrate, we're gonna celebrate 100. We're gonna 100, 100. We're gonna yeah, we'll probably be in the Bahamas by 100. What, what episode is this one? Ninety one. Ninety one. No, oh, yeah. Eight, eight weeks from. Oh, yeah, maybe. Yeah, yeah. we probably gonna be in Bahamas by then. Oh, that'll be fire. Let me see. Real niggas on the mic. Boy, tend on the camera. Real niggas on the mic. Yeah. See you next episode. You heard? Yes, sir. <laughs>